Another sad statistic tonight showing the increasing violence in this world of ours. More and more women at risk on the streets and even in their own homes are signing up for self-defence courses. As David Richardson reports, women are flocking to martial arts courses to learn how to protect themselves. They often feel themselves to be a target. They're travelling interstate and overseas. They're working back late. They might be carrying valuable documents or money. They go out alone. They're in positions where they can become a target. Throw in a couple of continuous punches if you feel you're able to. Karen Armstrong is national manager of the Jim Fung Win Chun Academy and an author of books on women's self-defence. From here, great four can attempt to use low heel kick. She's been training in martial arts for 15 years and while diminutive, she's deadly. There has been a rapid increase in the number of women learning Wing Chun. I think women are more aware nowadays of the need for safety. They're more prepared to take action on that need. Does it sadden you that the people you teach, in particular the women, have to inflict pain to protect themselves? I feel sad at the amount of violence in society. I feel sad to think of any victim who didn't ask to be damaged and who has been. And I feel sad to think of the rest of their life if they have survived the attack and their families. According to police statistics, one in three Australian women is physically assaulted by her husband. One in four women is sexually assaulted. I don't think about them inflicting pain. What I think about is them having the confidence and the ability to avoid and prevent most dangerous situations. Ildi Igai is a manager of the Social Security Department. She's trained in Wing Chun for six years and she's had to use her skill to stave off a larger man. He um, moved in and I felt incredibly threatened and intimidated so until I've actually done, I'd done it I hadn't realised what I'd done. All I did was step in with a low heel kick. Bang, he was on the ground. <laughs> Lawyer Kate Bradshaw took up self-defence for fitness and protection for on the street and the office, if need be. Dear, John! my office, mate. No! I said no. Come on, Kate. John, no! Just go home. John, no! Okay, okay. This is a bird's eye view of Karen Armstrong hitting back. Heaven help the guy who attacks her. Well, there's a mug in every story. This is quick. I think it hurt me more to attack you than it did for you to defend against me. Well, that's why the Wing Chun counterattack's so clever. <laughs> I just died. <laughs> a large proportion of women study Wing Chun because it was developed by a woman. That's right. And on Wednesday, January the 27th, 1993, that's life. Good night.